Welcome to The Gifts You Never Got, Part 1. Have you heard of the Mario game that was deemed too violent and dishonorable to exist? Well, that was Mario Spikers, and apparently it was true. Sometime around 2006, Canadian game developer Next Level Games had been working on a new Super Mario sports game shortly after the success of Mario Strikers Charged on the Wii. It was aimed to be just as edgy as the previous game, but this time with volleyball wrestling hybrid as its motif. The game was said to take place in multiple arenas, all with their own unique gimmicks, and each character was said to be much more physical and aggressive. However, this didn't sit well with Nintendo, stating that it betrayed Mario's characteristic brand of overall wholesomeness, and it went against the Japanese code of honor. I know most of us are thinking, oh wait, but Smash Brothers had a ton of Mario characters, why are they allowed to fight there? And well, simply put, the violence in Smash is just considered cartoony and goofy, but the violence in Super Mario Spikers was just apparently too realistic. Oh well. At least we got Punch-Out instead. 